I have seen a lot of novice designers or new designers or some graphic designers that are coming to the UI design or UX design field and they ask the first question, what should I learn to become a UI or UX designer? And how can I become a UI or UX designer? Sometimes I have seen such questions on Quora, which degree should I take to become UI or UX designer? So I'm going to answer step by step, very easily, very simplified version of how you can become good at UI design and then I'm going to discuss about user experience design. Now, UI design, uh, I have been freelancing from past 10 or 12 years as a UI designer and teaching from last three years. And there are four things, four things if you can master them, you can design anything, any user interface, any website, any mobile app. And those four things are number one, is color schemes so if you are good at color schemes you can design anything you can apply them accurately you can communicate your ideas using colors second is typography typography and how you can use that effectively in your design this is two important most important things i have seen designers that they use just typography and colors and they create awesome looking designs so just two things using just two things if you can master them Third is layout and composition, how different things are going to uh, take place, what are different grids, uh, grid systems, how we are going to space out different elements, how we are going to balance our design. Okay, so this is the third thing. Fourth thing is that we are going to learn some tool because we needed to apply all what I, we have learned. So uh, you can use Sketch, uh, you can use Adobe XD, you can use Photoshop, you can use Figma any UI design tool. So if you have learned all the three uh, basic skills, typography, layout composition, and color schemes, you can apply them anywhere. One more thing a lot of designers miss is that uh, design is actually solving a problem and you are designing for the users. You are not designing for other designers that they are going to uh, see your design piece and they are going to say, wow, this is great, this is awesome, what? colors he has used what are the gradients he has used or she has used so this is not the uh, main purpose of any design now coming to the ux design how you can become a ux designer or start building your career in that field now if you already have learned ui design i have talked about it in the previous section now we are going to um, dig into ux design now, ux design has two uh, basic uh, you can say concepts or you can say uh, two different things you can master to be a great UX designer. Number one is uh, user psychology and user behavior and how different users they behave with digital products, uh, how different users are going to behave on e-commerce sites. So this is actually human behavior. This is human computer in interaction sub subject. This There are different concepts, how uh, mental models or the different uh, mentality or user uh, what is going what is user actually expecting with your design what are his expectations and how your design is different from it so these are actually going to uh, be the basic concepts of UX design uh, limited memory and all that stuff so this is uh, actually the concepts of UX design that is human psychology and behavior with digital devices one number two is that uh, UX process. You need to learn the user experience design process. So design process is actually, you are going to investigate. This is the major portion. You are going to user research. You are going to get some interviews. You are maybe in the interviews, you are going to build some quick sketches or uh, quick um, prototypes of your app or your website, and you are going to test it to get some data from your users. Then you are going to gather that data and you are going to uh, make sense of that data by applying it on your whiteboard and making different groups. Okay, this is affinity diagram. Anyhow, then uh, this is the whole process. You are going to gather data from the user, make sense of that data, uh, design from that data, gather data, uh, test it with users, iterate and improve it. And that is going to, you know, keep on going and you are going to release the product after you are satisfied that uh, it, these are the things users actually need. So this is design, user experience design process and uh, everything that is working behind or improving that process is actually your user behavior 
and uh, user psychology uh, with choosing your product so this is actually two things okay these are the two things if you can master them you can become a user experience designer now how you can learn it you can learn watching uh, video tutorials i i don't recommend most of the tutorials on youtube you can go to udemy udemy or uh, skillshare for that and try to get some good courses and uh, fill uh, fill up that course i mean take that course okay so uh, second thing is that you can read some books there are four or five books i think i have another video where i have, I have recommended like three books for user experience design when you are going to start them and uh, these are few books uh, books you should you study like uh, we have this uh, uh don norman the book uh, the design of everyday things by don norman this is the book i think you should start with anyhow so these are the two things you can learn and master uh, i have been teaching from past 3 years and i ha- i have a lot of courses on typography visual design ui design user experience design and all the links are in the comments uh, sorry in the description below so if you would like to take a look at them don't try to buy them just take a look and see the contents i would be glad to you know um see that you have uh, you know gone or taken my bait anyhow okay so uh if you have any questions do ask me in the comment section below in the comments below subscribe if you like my video and i will be making more videos on user experience design books and courses that i recommend uh, stay tuned and we will meet in the next video